I feel like we're gonna make it bigger this year. Hmm. I got it. guys welcome back to Honda Day Boise 2023 I am so pumped for this event it's gonna be absolutely amazing now the biggest difference between this year and last year is that this year I actually showed up early so I got a nice fancy parking spot over there in the service center which is gonna be pretty sweet for photos videos and everything in between but as you can see a lot of awesome cars are already lining up so we have about 30 to 45 minutes before the official roll-in happens and I'll try to get as much footage as I can of all the sweet Hondas rolling into the event now there's gonna be music, there's food, there's Hondas, there's more Hondas, there's even more Hondas over there. So this should be a very Honda focused video and of course Honda Pro Jason is gonna be joining me here in just a little bit. Alright guys, so I got the Civic and the RSX here in the service bay and then joining me is Gabe with his Mint. 30,000 mile Civic EX, and then Brett with his CRZ, or I should say, my old CRZ is gonna be showing up as well, parking in that spot, because apparently he's done some pretty cool stuff to it. Now this morning has been absolutely jam-packed. I woke up at like nine, Honda Pro Jason came over, we went to the junkyard, had a full Honda junkyard adventure that you guys are gonna see here on the channel, uh, probably in an upcoming video. And then after that, we went and got lunch, which as you can imagine, was more burgers. And then after the burgers, we went back to the house, hung out for a little bit, got a quick shower in, and now I'm here. So I'm really excited. I really think that this year is gonna be the biggest Honda Day Boise ever, which technically there's only been two, so it should be the biggest Honda Day ever. Is that Honda Pro Jason? It is Honda Pro Jason. What kind? Of, what service is this? I was not offered the I golf cart. It's a VIP service, my friend. It is. What are you, are you checking out? Some Hondas, or what are you doing? Checking out all the cars. Checking out the dealership, all the cars. See what's here, who's here. It's early, but it's packed. Let me get a beat. I kick your funky like feet. What? Let me get a beat. I kick your funky like feet. Let me get a beat. I kick your funky like feet. Let me get a beat. I kick your funky like feet. So I don't know about you guys, but uh, I'm pretty hot right now. It's supposed to be like 80 degrees, right? On this asphalt, it is way hotter than this. Jeez, that's clean. Now here we have my RSX people. So last year, there was a handful of RSXs. I think there was like three or four or so. This year, we got five. Ah, we got six over here. Is that a genuine A-Spec lip? Yes sir, hell yeah. What, what do you, uh, you, like, I'll pay you right now. Maybe like 400 bucks in like a taco over there, right? Uh, a boba it. tea, <laughs> are you sure? I'd get it painted, I'd make it look really pretty, but it would just be on my car after that, right? right. This event is pretty massive. I mean, we have Hondas going from here, actually back all the way there, all the way to the very end of the parking lot. Uh, once the sun started going down a little bit, the temperatures started dropping, more and more even came out to play. And uh, the weather is finally nice, and uh, I'm not burning to death, because after a day at the junkyard with Jason and cruising top down in an S2000, 
let me just say I'm looking a little bit like a lobster right now. But this event has just been awesome, dude. The community's great. Everybody's been super nice. Look at this. I mean, tell me that's not the most fun that you've ever seen. <laughs> the most fun. Drone down, drone down. Oh, it's, it's okay. Oh, it's not okay. All right guys, so I had to get away from outside and the music to come back in here to check out the Honda CRZ. I know it's been a long time since anybody has seen an update on this car. Uh, and for what it's worth, this is actually my first time seeing it in almost a year. Brett picked it up and he's been, I guess, daily driving this thing for literally a year. So there's been no issues. It's been an awesome car. And within the last, I think, three days, he was able to source coilovers, wheels, tires, and get this thing lowered. And I'm just so thrilled to see this thing. I really did love this car. So for any of my CRZ fans watching this, just know that uh, I still miss it. Maybe eventually I'll have another one, but this thing is just way too cool. Dane, you're not supposed to be drinking that here at this event. Are you all day? I have a koozie on. Nobody knows what's in here. It could be anything. It could be anything. Probably a Sprite. It's literally, it's literally in your hand. I can literally see that, Gabe. It's a Sprite. Right. Jen, do you approve? Are you happy you got your attention? I didn't need... <laughs> now I can't put that in the video now. Yes, I did. All right, so the vibes are pretty perfect right now. I've just been talking to everybody, talked about his swap on his EG Coupe over there. But you know who I haven't seen? Where the heck is Honda Pro Jason? He must be out signing autographs or doing famous things. All right, Jason. So uh, I pulled you over for this. I want to get your thoughts. On my drink? No, not on the or drink. The Civic. How is the drink, though? I love the drink. Devil by Angel. Delicious. What flavor is it? It's um, a passion fruit flavor. Oh, I love passion fruit. Did you get the boba balls? I... No. Where are my you... balls? Why do I have no balls? I don't know. That's a weird, that's a personal question. There's here. doctors for that. No. Yeah. No. Have you seen this before? Is it like a regular I, I, car? No, I, I, I literally just Even saw it five minutes ago. Even the was like everything's matching and... Yeah. Dude, a lot of good circuit hero parts, 18-1S2000 steering wheel on there. Yep. Look at the rear, let's look at the conversion on the rear. Oh, is that beautiful. Pretty sweet, I, have you yeah. seen a lot of, have you seen a lot of these? That's like literally the first one I've ever seen. Um, I might have seen one outside like, you know, Japan There's or gonna whatever. be one like Honda Pro Jason, like super fan that knows you've seen one of these before. And Jason, you have seen one of these. Before on in, this video in, in the year 2017, and it was my car. How dare you forget it? <laughs> it was That's me. what's gonna happen. It was me. It was my car. No, this is sick. This is absolutely beautiful. Super crazy. I'm just walking around here, and there's a random golf cart that's just unattended. Keys are in it. So I mean, why you know why not, right? When in Rome, Ugh. how do you drive one of these things? Click this down. Oh, dude. Oh, dude. We're cruising right now, man. So last year they made me ride in the back. This year I'm taking over, dude. Dane! What are you doing? Hey, hop in! No, hop in, hop in. Hop in, hop in, hop in. We'll, 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 do, a, we'll do a lap right here. Dude, this thing's surprisingly quick, That's man. Kind of sprightly, yeah. it, it is. It's got a little bit of pep. We're, we're maxed out now. We're, I've never we're, been in one of these with a handle on the seat. This is actually pretty fun. Right? It's pretty comfortable. Yeah. You know what it makes you want to do, Dane? What? Makes you want to buy a car here at Larry Miller Honda. Ooh, what? What do we got to do to get yeah. you into a car today? Dude, the weather got so. This is so nice for a car show. I saw my favorite car here, back there. Did you see it? The NSX. The Honda Beat. I know, I know, yeah. I know, I know. The but Honda the NSX Beat. Is a close second. <laughs> so. Uh, hey, these people look familiar. There we go. Sydney. Hey. 
Hey! I almost made it to the car, but then he grabbed me. Yeah, we're just going for a cruise. <laughs> got the zebra seats, yes. What I love the most is the fact that we got the beat next to the NSX, know, right? right? In silver, both of them on TEs. Yeah. It's, that, that had to have been on purpose. Uh, this is when you hop out, we split ways. All right. Well, thanks for, uh, thanks for, I, I, it's a Ford Flex, Dane. I don't think anybody wants to. <laughs> Maybe you want something in the cooler back, just let me know. What's going on, dude? Is the drone, does the drone live again? No. My lips are beyond chapped and beyond sunburnt. I think I'm gonna grab some water. What up, dude? What's going on, man? Thanks for, uh, thanks for coming. Oh my God, you actually do have a cooler inside here. You came prepared. Dude, car show season. You're a lifesaver, Dane. Thank you very much. All right, so with water in hand, finally cooling off, we are gonna go check out the new Acura Integra Type S. Can't believe it. Dane, this is your first time seeing it, right? In person, yeah, I've never seen one in person. I'm getting chased! Oh. I, got, I got it, I got an after party at our house. You're more than welcome to come. After party? Yeah. What's going on, boys? You staying, you staying out of trouble? You're staying in trouble? Hey, oh, God. How, how old are you, kids? Seven? Seventeen? Se you, se you look fifteen. You're six? You look 12. Who's your Who's your parents? You don't got parents? Frank's your parent? <laughs> Frank, I need to talk to you about your son. Ah, uh, this is it. You've seen this though, haven't first time, you? First time ever? What? Hold on. Hold on. A first. What a first! Honda Pro Jason's first time seeing the new Acura Integra Type S. Not only is it my first time in Idaho, yeah, it's also my first time seeing this car. You look correct. Oh my God, is that? that is crazy, dude. So what do you think in person? So it's super aggressive, which I really like. I yeah. think they did a really good job uh, making it more aggressive. Like the wheel arches are really nice. I like how these are molded in. They're molded. It's not a bolt-on thing. They're, they're, well, not there. Aren't. Not there. Yeah, but back here. These are obviously bolt-on thing. I'm glad that Acura Honda realized that this piece is needed because it wasn't in the FK8 type R. Yeah. And a bunch of us were using the Boris kit, which is basically the same exact piece. Yep. So I'm glad they thought about that. I do like the copper wheels. I think they look really good on the car. Anyway. Look at those hoodlums, dude. So, so this is what we got. We have the accessory spoiler, which I love. Yeah. Um, we have the accessory black badge in the back, which I like. Okay. I don't know if I love it. I like it. I like a little bit more distinction between the blacks. I like more of a carbon or something. And the back one, the front like one lights up. like a gunmetal. I'd be happy with a gunmetal. Gun metal. The yeah. front one lights up. Yeah. The rear one doesn't. So okay. it's just like that, which is a little bit weird. Um, the exhaust is stock, but everyone's heard it already. It sounds amazing. It has all the bangs and pops that everybody loves. A lot of piano black in the back. Yep. But it's it's okay. I like it. I like that they didn't put any chrome on the car. I don't see any chrome. Everything's all blacked out the way it should be. A lot of times Honda leaves some chrome on their cars. Yeah. And Acura is same. No, it's clean. But it, no, it, it's yeah. clean. The lines are super aggressive. The hood looks great. I really am a big fan of the hood. and Yeah, I'm a huge fan. All, I mean, I don't know if you can get it on film, but... There are so many levels to this hood. Even the front's got a crease, a real tiny crease up the middle. Yep. So it's just really big and bulky and just massive. This lights up, which I think is really cool little touch. Yep. So I'm a huge fan. Like I'm I'm a 100 percent yeah. No, it's, I'm a big fan. It's a good looking car, but it is. just hear me out. What do you think? FL5 rear spoiler on the back. Oh, we've talked about that earlier. We talked about that. Okay, just just hear me let, out. Let me right? take a look for a second. Hear, let me take a look. Hear me out. Hear me out. Just Take the duck bill away or leave the duck bill there, right? You do your two holes right here, right? And I'm wondering because you know how how over. Honda and Acura think about these things. I'm very curious if this yeah. if this hatch was popped, if there'd be the two dimples there where an aftermarket something would go. There might be. Do you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah. They kind of set things up for different ideas later. No, I like it. It's part of the mold, and so I'm just curious. Yeah, I think that might be a good idea. First of all, whoever was in charge of deciding to paint this and not leave it black, thank you very much, because you left it black in the FL5 and it looks horrible. It yeah. needs to be color matched. People people are wrapping them because it of just, Of course, yeah, they have yeah. to, it just doesn't fit. It's like, the whole car's white and then that's black. The whole car's red, the whole car's, it's like, stop doing that. We don't need the excess up there. It's, and you, it's you, just you also know that's one of the hardest things to remove on most cars. Well, I can imagine the whole headliner, the whole headliner comes out. Drop. Yeah. 100%. Yeah, no, I like it. And I'm, I'm gonna tell you right now that I don't know if I like it for eight thousand dollars more. Like slightly less clutch. Is 
the sound of our people, Jason. Okay, I don't know if I like this for eight thousand dollars more than the FL5. Yeah. Like, if it had a sunroof and a fifth seat. Yeah. I'd say eight thousand dollars more. Like it offers a lot more than the FL5 does, but it it is amazing and I love it. And I would I'm not talking down about the car at all, but I would have just liked it just for it to have a couple extra things to make it a little bit more luxurious versus the FL5. Yeah. That's all, all I like. I think they, they try to do that with the seats, right? Which the seats, I like I like the Type R seats. No, the seats are great big. in both cars. Yeah, but these seats, they're meant to be a little bit more, you know, they, robustly comfortable and whatnot, I, if that's a correct even thing to say. They're more robustly comfortable. Yes. Yeah. But they need to put a fifth seat in there. It's yeah. a luxury car. So but that no, might be a problem. I, no, but I, I do like it very much. And I will tell you something that I've never said on film before. If you guys would like to hear this, I've never owned an Acura. Ever. Ever? I've had over 50 Hondas, never had an Acura. The Acura Integra could be my very first Acura I'll ever own if they come out with a PMC Gotham Gray. So PMC edition, yeah. Integra Type S in Gotham Gray, yep. and keep the number under 50. Okay, well, that'd be a very expensive car, maybe. We'll the see. The TL TLX Type S. Yeah. 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 Under 50, though? Under 50. Okay. I'm in. Okay. In fact, I have my name on one at a dealership. All That's right. how in I am. Somebody is watching this. Huh? Jason's already giving you his money. There you go. Get right? done. <laughs>
All right, we'll go check them out. Yeah, some tons of I think you have tons of photos on there, right on your page of you going to hit the stack, yeah. right? Yeah, some there's good some stuff. Out there. I don't have a lot of footage because it's on another computer because we're still moving. So. Yeah, no, dude, no, no, no worries, man. You done a great job with the car. It looks awesome, and um, hopefully, eventually, when Idaho gets a track someday, let's get out there. Well, yeah, we'll get to see this thing roll. All right, so you know the show's ending when the uh, the rain starts, but you know what? That was perfectly timed. Could, that couldn't have been better time. If rain was going to happen... Looking awfully cool over there, Steve. What are you doing? Are you creeping? You taking photos of that car that you want to buy? Dude, you know you want it. Dude, I... Well, that's because it's... Yeah. Let's build one together. You want to build a Honda together? Are you paying for it? This is Frank's mobile design. Dude. Yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> You're crazy, dude. They're gonna kick us out of Larry Miller Honda. All right, guys, so that is gonna be a wrap for today for Honda Day Boise 2023. It's been an absolute blast. And Jason, thanks for coming out, man. I had so much fun here. It was a total surprise. Like, I didn't know what to expect. Like, 20 cars or like 200 cars. We had over 200 cars here, for sure. And the people were awesome. The builds were amazing. I absolutely loved it. And I will tell you guys something. I will definitely be back for Honda Day 2024 Boise because I love Boise. What do you want me to say? You like, you like the burgers, you like the fries. The people, the fries, you know what it is? Yeah. Everything's just so cool and calm. I don't feel rushed. Yeah. I really like it. And the burgers are pretty epic, so I appreciate you. That's just that it's just living in Idaho, man. So next year, hopefully yeah. we'll have you back. This has been just an amazing event. Thank you to Larry Miller Honda for putting this on. I mean, this has just been, this has just been absolutely awesome. And so again, guys, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the footage. Hopefully you guys enjoyed just being a part of the experience. So as always, with my mic facing in the right direction, if you guys enjoyed the video, enjoyed the Hondas, enjoyed seeing Honda Pro Jason, please make sure to give me a big thumbs up. Subscribe down below for more, and I'll catch you guys the next one. Salt Anthony. Peace.